I always try to look at every IP project through the eyes of their fans. If I manage to make the fans of the franchise happy or engaged, then I feel like I have succeeded. There's always a lot of expectations linked to a, such a well-established IP as Dune. So to create the world of Arrakis, I researched a lot of satellite imagery from Earth. There are some amazing looking deserts and mountain ranges and I managed to download some really useful height map information. And I can use these height maps in Photoshop and modify it as I need to. And then I can add this to my 3D software, extrude the terrain in 3D so I can get the lights and shadows set properly and use that as a great foundation. I also got some really useful mood boards from the designers at Simon because there are some very specific terrain types that we need to convey. Uh, for the board, for the players to understand. This board is the biggest board I've ever worked on. I have a history from over 400 board game projects and this weighs in also at 15 gigabytes. So it's also the, the biggest file I've ever worked on. Uh, so I'm happy I've recently upgraded the memory on my computer back here. Working on such a high resolution board has been quite a challenge. I need to limit myself in uh, terrain types because we need to keep each area distinctive. So I put all my, my love and work into the details of the, of the terrain. So if you zoom out and you look at the map, scale down, it, uh, you don't see all the details. So hopefully people will <laughs> dive onto the game board and experience the world of Arrakis from a close point of view. I really hope that you will check out the Kickstarter and that you will consider helping us bring Dune World for Arrakis to the gaming table.